going on, people? Arsenal 2, Newcastle 0. You know, we got the three points. Most important thing. But by God, that was an absolute shit first half performance. That first half performance was absolutely dreadful. You know, Abamyang, fuck me. He's missing from one yard out. Somebody please explain to me how Abamyang is missing from one yard out. Before the game, I wanted um, Lacazette to start because... You know, Aubameyang, like I've said before, I've got no flow for him. He's done great for us for over the years, but he's on a massive decline. How's a man missing from one yard out? Someone please explain that to me. Even in the second half, there was a chance that he ran on, could have ran onto and, and popped it away. Aubameyang, a couple seasons ago, would have done that. So for me, we need a striker. We need a striker now. We need a striker fast because we can't. We're not getting no goals. We're on minus two goals difference in the Premier League. That's a shambles. That's an absolute shambles. We're sitting fifth, level on points in fourth, minus two. Get me? Like, that's a big factor if we want to even challenge. Because if we want to challenge for that fourth, that fourth place, goal difference is going to come into it. And we need to we need to actually start scoring some goals. Because in the first half, the touch was shit. Yeah, they couldn't really find no passes. You know, Ramsdale made a bad boy save to tip the ball over the bar. And Newcastle are shit. Newcastle are at the bottom of the t bottom of the table, yeah. And we need to be turning over teams like this at the Emirates. Like we raw need to be turning over teams like this at the Emirates. We came out second half, yeah. Saka, you know what? Saka for me, Saka played very well. He deserved the man of the match award because even from the first half when the team was playing shit, he was still trying his thing, still dribbling in and out, in and out, trying to do what he can do. Scored the first goal in the second half. You know, made that run, shown the, the, the passion to, to get into the box and try to, to take players on. So for me, Saka did his thing. He came off with a little injury, but I'm just watching now. He's doing an interview here, so he seems all right. He seems pretty well. Let me just slap the subtitles on here, Susex, so I can see what's going on as well. Martinelli. There we go as well, Martinelli. I've been crying out for him to start. Well, not even start, come on 60 minutes, show people what he can do, show the manager what he can do. My man's been bringing him on with one minute to go. Do you know what I mean? Man can't do nothing with one minute to go. So for me, you know, all praise to Martinelli. Came on, couple seconds, nice touch, good finish, you know, shown Arteta what, you know, what he should be, should be doing. Because people like Martinelli, yeah, is going to be a wasted talent on Arsenal, just like Saliba is at the moment. Because for me, William Saliba needs to come back in as well. But Martinelli, sick, scored a goal. Saka scored a goal. And I think Saka's looking all right now. He doesn't look like he's injured. I think it was just more of a precautionary measure that he came off. But yeah, most important of all, we got the three points. The second half, we came out and we looked like we played a little bit better. Nuno Tavares, you know, he played well, but his final ball needs to scratch up on his on his last last decision making. But Tierney, I don't know why Tierney's, I think Tierney might be carrying a little knock or something, because for me, Tierney should be coming on in the second half or something, just to see, give him a little run out, because, you know, he's not like he's been dreadful, and know Tavares has not done so bad, but he's been taking like four or five shots that are hitting the fucking sky. So for me, I don't know why Tierney's not, not getting a little chance as well. Um, Lakonga put in a solid performance, you know, he, he, he managed to sit back and, and break the play up and he, he done it. He looked like his partnership with Partey is coming along, but we need more, we need more creativity. We had 23 shots in the game and we had, I think, six on target. That just shows we need a striker. We need a striker because our two strikers that we've got now, they're old and they're, they're, they're just they're just spiralling downwards. Obviously, Lacazette's a bit better with the link-up play. Aubameyang is the one thing that he was great at finishing. Now it seems to be like that's that's missing right now. So, guys, that's Arsenal 2, Newcastle 0. The most important thing, we got them three points. You know, we bounced back from the Liverpool result, which was very disappointing. Um, but, yeah, Manchester United next. And to be fair, we've got to have a much better performance than that at Old Trafford if we weren't getting any points from that game. So yeah, big up guys.